Ah, the Cup 3 days, summer's most anticipated or enduring event in the Baltic states. This is not like a Latvian championship, where all you want to do is win. Well, this sort of is like that, but way bigger. You know, there are 2000 people usually attending this competition, so it's huge. I remember being a little kid and having a blast taking part in this orienteering competition. It was always my most anticipated event of the year. And as I was waiting for a couple of three days the whole year, I didn't practice much orienteering because that was that was not what I usually did with my family. But we did go to Cup of Three Days, which was a tr tradition of ours. Anyways, at the start of my life, in the youngest group fall, the eight-year-olds, I actually won. And the following year, I got the fourth place, which is incredible. And it just shows that I had the talent to perform. I just needed to practice and train daily, or at least weekly, to have better results in the future. Sadly, that didn't happen. As we can see from the following year's results, I freaking sucked. I always competed in the noob group, you know, and and even so, in that group, I still was towards the bottom of the results. And that just shows how <laughs> important it is to train, because as you can see, I had not practiced or trained or orienteering at all. In the most recent years, I've been starting to get into orienteering yet again, Last year, I actually got the 10th place, which is not that good, you know, but the thing was that I ran 10 kilometers while being lost throughout the three days, which is insanely a lot, and I, all, I lost like an hour to the first place, so the thing that bothered me the most is that I couldn't orienteer. <laughs> you, can, you can just see that from the results, I was not able to do so, and so here is how it went. At the start of the race, I, I was doing really good, you know, and I started risking it more and more, and now you can see what happens when you don't have the necessary training <laughs> prior to the competition, and uh, yeah, I messed up there, there, I messed up also there, oh shit, what happened, yeah, I messed up, and... Uh, if it not, okay, if it had not been those mistakes, I would have podium, you know. This year, I have been training hardcore. So as you can see from my Endemondo statistics, I have started orangeering in 2017. I have ran almost 100 kilometers. This year alone, which you have to keep in mind, is only half a year has passed. I have ran 230 kilometers while orienteering, which is a lot, which means I am prepared enough. Basically, this means that I'll translate it for you. For the next year, my goal is to learn how to orienteer and podium in the Cup 3 days competition. And this year, my goal is to podium. I will vlog throughout the process and I hope I will not get lost and I really hope I will do well so see you in the competition maybe and we'll see how it goes I will make a movie about this because this is my goal of the year let's go